Hi, David Montoya here again, and we have another nice video for you. And this is a video, uh, it's an older one that we did a training on, and we actually, uh, this was just the finish of it. We didn't actually show the patio that we poured and stuff like that, but it has the finish. It has an outdoor kitchen, it has the bowl, the sink in the outdoor kitchen. We did a bench, fire pit, uh, the waterfall, so you can get to see all of it. But this is the finish and the completion. There's a lot of good training uh, material in here, so don't, you know, uh, slow it down watch how we're doing coloring uh pablo was on this here pablo montano very good trainer and he helped a lot with this and you'll see he takes the time and shows exactly what to put you know the the ratios of colors we polish this we generally don't polish our, our countertops but we polish this one um just a lot of things in there that you get to see that what might help you in doing what you're doing when you're doing when you're doing uh the projects and things that we do. So check it out. It's really nice. Um, here's the finish. It turned out very nice. Uh, the sealers and everything when it was complete. Check it out. And then rinse it off before you go back to the white. It's not light, it's just light. Can't 
see none of that. Wait, wait. That one's black and that one's black. So I think about it. Black is on the right hand side. That guy told me the story. It's like I've heard. And it's just there on the phone to me. Waiting for the end. And he said, let me tell you. We have turtles, but we don't have any like snapping turtles. Oh, yeah. No. Snapping turtles, monsters. Garfish, little monsters. You know what a garfish is? Mm -hmm. It looks just like a regular fish, but with an alligator head. Oh, really? Man. Oh, let's actually take a picture of this. This is cute. <laughs> Hey guys, can we get everyone over here? It's not labeled or anything, so that's how you know. You'll get what, six, six of, of these? those. Six of these with your kit. Um, so when you're mixing vertical, you always add your vertical into your, your liquid first. Always, and you always mix the vertical in with the liquid before you add your other concrete. You know what? I think that will do it out of this place. You want concrete coming up? No. Type S. Comes in the green white bags. They have 60 pound bags too, that's why we say 80 guys. Roll 
this is fast. Okay. Watch how Dave's applying it, guys. Easy. Oh. leave a little thickness on that thing, okay? Nope, leave it alone. Let it, let it sit. good to have seven mil gloves or a thicker gloves especially so you don't keep ripping them so Harvard Freight best place to go for uh, gloves seven mil nine mil and they're cheap too see this stuff wants, it's gonna want to peel so let me show you something so that's why it's important to make sure the lath is all screwed in because it moves it'll, it'll want to drop This one. What movie is this one? 20 bucks, 20 bucks on it. Ooh! Yeah. It got that crack, though. Yeah, that's because of the line. It's coming out. But, it, but it's bulging now, so we'll be able to buff it down. To yeah, we'll buff it down. All right, you see, like, you see this one compared to the other one? Yeah, this one looks like the, the colors got mixed. All right. Get both the drains. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we pre-drilled the hole for our sink. And, okay, there you go. There we go. Oh, that was easy. Oh, wait, can we do that one more time? Yep, the cool thing is we have the sprayers and stuff on the sides mm -hmm. of this thing. Just, you can just use it as a sprayer. <laughs> <laughs> This is all. Oh my god. Very oh, you recording? Yeah. Okay. So we pre drilled that hole for the sink.
So what are you guys doing? Just kind of mixing up the colors? Yeah, we're just mixing up the colors, going from light to dark. Because the dark seeps through more than the lights, so you want to get your lights in there because once you go, you start with the dark, then it's pretty much a lost cause. You're not going to get any other colors on there. So you want to make sure you go really, really, really light with the with the blacks. And you want to start yeah. off with your honey. Shadow. So you'll, you'll dip it in the honey, you know. Nice, get liberal now. Come in. You can paint the whole rock, that you way know, you get a nice base coat. And then you can you know, you just barely touch the black, even wipe it off, and then you just add that little tint of black on there. Just frozen? Just like that. And then you do that with some amber. Go over it with the amber. And then as it dries, it'll start, it'll look like this. You know, as it dries, all the, all them colors just burst out. It just looks, looks real nice. What colors are you using? We got a nutmeg, amber, black, and a honey. The, uh, and uh, the dilution for the black, we just do a one to, one to five, one to six. <laughs> and then uh, for these ones, usually like a three or four to one for all the other colors. It just depends on how like, how dark how dark the colors are. Is, um, you just want to go by, you know, just you, you, te you can go three to one at first, test it out on a small portion. And then if it's too, too rich in color, then you add more water. You want to make sure you use distilled water with all these, um, with these colors. And um, that's pretty much the ratios of the colors. You can't really mess that up. 18 to three. <laughs> Yeah, I'm working. Got proof, people. You do have proof. <laughs> you got me here, bro? Ah, you do, though. It sticks even better. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe old. <laughs> Maybe old. Some people are like, all right. Who is the kid? And his voice. That's good. I'm sick. I'm sick of doing all the work anyway. Oh, you got that on top? I did. <laughs> Just for you, Tony. <laughs> I kind of moved too fast. I went. You got to keep on diluting. One thing about the mix when you're painting, you got to keep diluting it as you go because what happens is you use the top and it settles to the bottom. And you want to keep on uh, diluting that. You know, dilute the color. Keep on add a little bit of water to so keep it up. That way, you're, you're, you're all light one color, and then it gets too dark. See, it's real dark right there. Really dark. Yeah, dilute that up. And only go one rock at a time separately. And then use honey with it, or use different colors with it. Okay. Too many colors left on honey. I like it this way. Is that all I was supposed to say? <laughs> sure. Put me up with some of the... Uh... Honey? The name appears to say uh, mid suicidal thoughts, bad nightmares. 
All right. That's what you want to do. Yeah, a lot of it's, it, it, oh, <laughs> diarrhea. <laughs> uh, no. Nah. Wait a minute. It causes constipation and diarrhea. I've never seen nothing like that in my life. I'm like, how does it cause it? Bro? That's <laughs> what I use for warm oh, sound off. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't know that, huh? Yeah. All right. All right. Thank you. Guess what, guys? Good news. The toilet. The toilet finally showed up with two hours to go. Yay! But, but that Indian food I got coming, you're gonna need it. Yeah. That's it. That's how they do it. I'll show you how I did the face. I have it on video. <laughs> yeah, them, them bugs will get you if you just stand around. The black flies on you, yeah. Nope. They'll bite too. I caught that. aren't working, you get bit. I like that, dude. Maybe the black sheep aren't that great. Yeah. You can tell a little bit. Yeah, I want it. Soaking in the sun, make a strong will and a The candy man. The candy man. The candy man. Oh. See, now it's kind of creepy to me. Oh, see, that big candy man. Honestly, it's as if the lava makes the world. This is the hardest part. Not thinking. This is the hardest part. Right up here. Everything is. You just gotta get oil. Wait till this is just as perfect. Talk about the child. Oh, we should be right. You know, we should be at their first season. Come on, man. I stopped smiling when life got real. Really? <laughs> Who can take tomorrow deeper than a dream? Oh, yeah. Set the Okay, 
take the house as you pick it up. So we got 1800 now, and then we're going to put it down to a, uh, I mean, it's already getting down there pretty good. Yeah, we got a 3500. So we got a 3500, there's 1800 brand new one, and there's 220. This one is done with that, we can do a 3500. That looks really good. Look at these strands like that. Take them down to double T's. I'm going to them down to my ankle. <laughs> <laughs> show them a good time. Yeah. Make this money. Hey. For NBA, that's short, bro. 
Nate most, Robinson was a beast. See, I yeah, like, but most point guards in the NBA, I bet you, like, average is 16 to 3. I'm going to tell you what I don't like about Isaiah. He get majority, he get about, okay, yeah, he get about 30 points a game, 29, 28. But, 20, like, 18 of them points are free throws. But that's what his game is. He knows that he's a smaller guy, and then he can get in there, and he's going to catch the foul every time. I'll tell you this out. And majority of teams that he did it on, they ought to have bigger people, bigger men. They don't play Cavs, Golden State, Rockwell, kind of the Rockets, borderline. A couple of them teams. Well, I can play big man ball, but. They'll switch to a small man ball. Also. Golden State definitely doesn't play big man ball. Golden State is far from big man ball. No, they're not big man ball. Big man ball. Big man ball. Yeah. Big man ball. The waterfall. Yay! Yeah. Oh, can move. Huh? So you talk, man. Can move quick. Okay. Come in here. I'm sure he can. I know. I mean, you'll stop st stress and check. You stop stressing, check. <laughs> what I've been trying to tell you, but do you ever listen to me? No. 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 In your once in your life, Tony, I'd love for you to listen to me. Maybe. Maybe. Next life. No. And I'm gonna mud the inside. And the reason why I'm using stone rock is because it has a it has a lot more of the fibers, so it gives it additional strength. So we'll go through the inside, get every crease, take a nice little glob, go from the bottom, and basically just work your way up. Well, now I like to say, I like to always tell people to flare these edges out because if you don't, once it dries up, it just leaves a little lip and then eventually it, it can crack off or whatever the case may be, but it just, it helps adhere or it becomes one with the product that it's getting put onto. So just flare it out just like that, Add a little bit more. And you can push it through the push it through the crack as well. Um, just gives it a lot more support. Bring him to the waterfall. Bring him to the waterfall. Just like that. This is how we see you don't need the radio. You're doing a good job, Tony. You kiss my <laughs> I like it. I'm not ashamed of it. Dude, the song. Good? Okay. Good. Hey, you guys want to watch out?
So right, right so now oh. <laughs> in stereo. Yeah. Yeah. I'm trying not to get close. 